Mr. Wood, what did you see here today? Well, I, I saw a lot of people come out uh, who I think share the frustrations of, of many Americans, which is and many Californians, uh, which is simply that when you when you look at the economic trajectory of the state and a host of other issues, uh, we seem to be going in a direction that's contrary to the to the interests of the people. And so, you know, you look at the amount of debt, of course, you look at the amount of debt, of course, that's that's piling up. You look at the increase in taxes. Uh, you look at where California ranks in terms of so many different uh, categories, educationally and otherwise. Uh, people are concerned about that. And so, you know, I, I saw a lot of people coming out to express their frustration, but also, I think, to try and uh, to, to try and sow some seed for a more optimistic vision of what the future of California could be. And that was part of what I tried to come out here to articulate today. Did you speak? Did you... I did, yeah. Well, I, uh, just so you know, yeah, I'm running for Congress in the 43rd District of California. I am, uh, which happens to be a seat currently held by uh, Miss Maxine Waters. And uh, it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, it's an area I think that needs a lot of help. It's largely an inner city district. And part of my, part of my purpose in coming out here today was not not just so much to highlight what may be going wrong in the country and in the state of california and so forth but also to try and suggest that if we're going to fix a lot of these problems whether they be whether they be economic or educational or otherwise that we need to i think facilitate a dialogue between the parties that's 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 based i think on a platform of mutual goodwill and respect it's not always the easiest thing to accomplish not always the easiest thing to accomplish in politics but i think that it's vitally important so that was a point that I wanted to, to, to make out here today uh, to my fellow Republicans. Republicans when, and conservatives, I should say. When is the election for you? The election is on, uh, well, the primary election is June 3rd, and the general election is November 4th. Uh, now, I will be the candidate, um, I will be the other candidate in the general election. Uh, there were multiple uh, candidates for this uh, race going into the primary, but uh, I'm happy to say that we've performed at such a level in my campaign to where our other opponents have dropped out. So it is me and Maxine at this point. Um, but again, my, my emphasis isn't so much on running against Maxine as for running for a positive vision that people can rally around. But yes, the dates are June 3rd for the primary and November 4th for the general.